hi welcome back to rebecca's travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel hi welcome back to rebecca's lifestyle hi how are you all doing i hope everybody's as well as possible hi if you're new here to my channel please subscribe and a big thumbs up and thank you for doing so and um, i really appreciate it and um thank you for the recent subscribers and people for leaving me comments and um, um, it's been really uh, good to get in touch with you. Um, today I'm going to be doing a budget travel special 10 exciting facts October 2023. This is um, from throughlytravel.com. Through um, I have mentioned um, a lot of these uh, before, but there are new ones. Um, number one, um, first of all, is to make a budget. How much um, to budget for? Um, travel is completely personal and um, it will depend entirely on your situation. And the same goes for uh, saving money when traveling. It depends on your income, expenditure and other factors um, in your life. Um, number two, we advise uh, saving money uh, to uh, cover, saving enough money to cover necessities like food, accommodation, travel if it's not include, uh, covered in your holiday, and as well as um, a top priority activities that you uh, want to do. And uh, leave a little for an emergency, um, just in case you need it. Um, again, it's really good. Um, so then you know that you've got enough money. Um, and you don't need to worry about that. Uh, number three, be uh, cost conscious and uh, price aware individual. Um, so be aware if a, a certain company or place is um, overcharging you. Um, and no, uh, number four, research how much that something should cost so you're not overpaying. Um, you can track part at prices such as Google Flight or Skyscanner. Number five, uh, look for sales. Uh, many operators run seasonal sales around Christmas and summer. Um, whichever way you decide to travel, um, whether it's by flight, coach, a lot of operators um run sales around christmas and summer which is dramatically um which will dramatically cut your costs and um also number six compare prices on third party websites like booking.com but um booking the hotel uh, directly can get you the best price um um for your accommodation also um number seven booking a non-refundable rate um is always cheaper than booking a flexible rate so if there's no reason why um you're going to change your plans then uh, you might as well book a non-refundable rate because obviously you're going to set it save uh, more money that way but obviously again it depends on your situation if you think your plans are going to change then um you'd be better to book the uh, the flexible refundable rate and um, number eight um plan to visit um places uh, that are good for traveling on a budget some countries are much cheaper than others like um in europe uh portugal and say poland um is going to be say a lot cheaper uh than uh, um 
than say somewhere like say the Canary Islands or say some of the Greek islands um, as mainland Spain and mainland Greece um, is che uh, cheaper than going to island, uh, islands and um, yes it's again also going to be cheaper than going to somewhere uh, like Cyprus as well um, which is again another island um, and also uh, countries such as uh, France, Germany, Austria, Switzerland um, again um, are more expensive countries in Europe to visit um, again Australia is a more expensive wor a worldwide place to visit than say somewhere like India or Thailand, um, etc. So, um, number nine, always read uh, reviews to find um, hidden perks like free upgrades. Um, read uh, TripAdvisor reviews um, on the accommodation that you want to stay in. And um, and number 10, avoid extra fees. Um, rec recommend using a travel card like Revolut um, when traveling abroad to take advantage of the best exchange rates and to avoid overseas charges to your bank um, or that your bank may charge you. Um, again, it depends entirely on your bank but they recommend uh, using a travel card like uh, Revolut so I would like to say thank you for watching today and I'll see you tomorrow um, uh, with um, another exciting um, Marble Square update um, because the work um, has definitely started now on Marble Square Colville so I can't wait um, to show you the new update on Marble Square. So please keep watching and have a good day and night wherever you are in the world. Thank you and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.